So you're scouring through the web for the ideal destination, searching far and wide all across the six continents. Well, seven, if Antarctica is on your travel bucket list. I'm here to tell you to look no further, because here's where we come in. In this video, we've got you covered. Whether you're seeking a breath of fresh air in a dreamy village, a romantic getaway, or just a chance to relax and recharge, there's something for every type of traveler on this list. So what are you waiting for? Pack your bags, grab your camera, and let's explore these dreamy destinations before they become the next hotspot. Number 28. Göreme, Turkey Situated right in the heart of Cappadocia, Göreme is a magical place that seems to have been plucked straight from a fairy tale. The town itself is nestled in a valley, so you'll be surrounded by beautiful cliffs on all sides. Göreme's history is as rich and fascinating as its geography. In the early days of Christianity, this region was a refuge for persecuted Christians who carved churches and monasteries into the soft rock of the fairy chimneys. The town is also famous for its cave hotels, which are built right into the rock formations. Gudeme is known as the hot air balloon capital of the world. Every morning, dozens of colorful balloons take to the sky, creating a magical sight that you won't soon forget. Number 27. Egisheim, France. Egisheim, city of three castles, where wine is king and life is beautiful, as the locals proudly say. This charming Alsatian village is located in the eastern region of France, in between the Vosges Mountains and the Rhine River. If you had ever thought what a European village would look like a century ago, this is the place for you. With its cobblestone streets, traditional houses, and flower-filled balconies, you can't help but experience the fairy tale like atmosphere that will take you back in time. The village is also surrounded by vineyards and forests, making it all the more serene. The vineyards that surround the village produce some of the best wines in France, including the famous Riesling and Gewürztraminer. Number 26. San Gimignano, Italy This fascinating medieval hilltop town is located in the province of Siena, in Tuscany, Italy. It's perched on a hilltop, offering breathtaking views of the rolling hills and vineyards that Tuscany is famous for. San Gimignano is known as the City of Towers, boasting 14 medieval skyscrapers that date back to the Middle Ages. These towers were built by wealthy families as a display of power and wealth. To avoid the crowds, the best time to visit is during the spring and autumn seasons. San Gimignano is also famous for its gelato, so be sure to try some during your visit. Gelateria Dondoli is a popular spot, offering unique flavors such as saffron and pistachio. Number 25. Puebla, Mexico Surrounded by volcanoes and mountains, Puebla is located in central Mexico, about 60 miles southeast of Mexico City. The city was founded in 1531 by the Spanish conquistadors and quickly became an important center of trade and culture. One place that is a must-visit is the Cathedral of Puebla. 
This stunning cathedral took over 300 years to build and is a mix of Gothic, Renaissance, and Mexican Baroque styles. The interior of the cathedral is equally impressive with ornate altars, frescoes, and a large pipe organ. And if you're out for a stroll, you cannot miss Avenida Juarez, a beautiful tree-lined street that stretches for several blocks. It's a popular spot lined with a variety of cafes, restaurants, and shops, ranging from high-end boutiques to street vendors. Number 24. Raja Ampat, Indonesia Considered one of the most biodiverse marine habitats on the planet, made up of over 1,500 small islands surrounded by crystal-clear turquoise waters teeming with marine life, Raja Ampat is an archipelago located in the West Papua province of Indonesia. The archipelago is home to a wide variety of bird species, including the rare Wilson's Bird of Paradise. Believe it or not, this location is still under the radar. You can explore the area by boat, snorkeling or diving, and discover a variety of coral reefs, fish, and other marine creatures. The best time to visit Raja Ampat is from October to April, during the dry season when the waters are calm and visibility is at its best for diving and snorkeling. Number 23. Shirakawago, Japan Known not only for being a UNESCO World Heritage Site, Shirakawago is also famous for its traditional gasozukuri farmhouses. These thatched roof houses have a unique design that resembles two hands joined in prayer, which helps to withstand heavy snowfall. Located in the central region of Japan, Shirakawago is situated in a remote mountainous area, and the nearest major city is Takayama, which is about an hour's drive away. The main attraction of Shirakawago is the Ogimachi village, with over 100 gasozukuri houses. Visitors can explore the village by foot, visit the museums, and even stay overnight in a traditional farmhouse. If you're visiting during the winter months, be sure to dress warmly, as temperatures can drop below freezing. Number 22. Rothenburg ob der Taube, Germany One of the best preserved medieval towns in Europe, Rothenburg ob der Taube is located in the Franconia region of Bavaria. Today, visitors can still experience the town's well-preserved architecture, including its famous city walls, towers, and half-timbered houses. Be sure to visit the Crime Museum. This unique museum showcases the history of crime and punishment in Germany, featuring exhibits on medieval law and order, torture devices, and infamous criminals. A thing to keep in mind is that this is a car-free town, and visitors are encouraged to explore the town on foot or by bike. The town's compact size makes it easy to navigate, and visitors can easily explore all the major landmarks and attractions within a few days. Number 21. Fenghuang, China Occupying the deep mountains and valleys of Hunan province, this ancient town will stir your soul. Fenghuang, also known as Phoenix Ancient Town, is famous for its well-preserved Ming and Qing dynasty architecture and its picturesque natural scenery. 
The town is built on the banks of the Tuojiang River, which winds its way through the town and adds to its charm. As you wander the cobblestone streets, take in the rich tapestry of history surrounding you. A strategic stronghold for centuries, Feng Huang protects tales from dynasties past within its walls. Don't forget to take a boat ride along the Tuojiang River, which winds its way through the town lined with traditional houses and shops. Number 20. Bibbury, England. This postcard perfect Cotswold village with its renowned Arlington Row cottages is surrounded by beautiful countryside and is a popular destination for walkers and nature lovers. Just a short drive from both London and Cheltenham, yet worlds apart, Bibbury is the quintessential escape to English countryside charm. The village is home to several historic buildings, including the 12th century St. Nicholas Church and the 17th century Bibbury Manor. With a population of just under 600, many of its shops and restaurants close early in the evening. Be sure to plan your journey accordingly. If you're a fan of traditional English pubs, then we recommend you visit the Bibbury Inn, which serves a range of local ales and hearty pub food. Number 19. Freudenburg, Germany. Freudenburg is located in the Siegerland region of Germany, which is known for its forests, hills, and historic towns. The town is also home to the world's largest ironworks, which has been in operation since the 15th century. Visitors can still explore the town's medieval past by visiting museums, historical landmarks, and cultural attractions. We recommend exploring the medieval Freudenberg Castle, a 12th century fortress that offers surreal panoramic views of the Siegerland countryside. For a more relaxing adventure, take a serene boat ride along the River Lahn, a beautiful waterway that winds through the region. You can choose from a variety of boat tours, from short trips to full-day excursions, and take in the captivating scenery that surrounds you. Number 18. Tasmania, Australia. Once the home of the Tasmanian tiger, this island state of Australia is known for its stunning natural beauty and mild, temperate climate. Though the Tasmanian tiger has been extinct on the island since the 1930s, the island still boasts a diverse array of wildlife and outdoor adventures. You can explore the many national parks, enjoy the dreamlike coastal drives, and immerse in the history and culture of the region. The main attraction that pulls in thousands to Tasmania is its stunning natural beauty. From the breathtaking Cradle Mountain Lake St. Clair National Park to the stunning Wine Glass Bay in the Freycinet National Park, Tasmania is a nature lover's paradise. Number 17. Isle of Skye, Scotland. Located off the northwest coast of Scotland, this destination promises an unforgettable experience for travelers seeking history, culture, and natural beauty. The island was once inhabited by the Picts, and later by the Vikings, who undoubtedly left their mark on the local culture and language. 
Today, the island is a stronghold of Gaelic culture, with many residents still speaking the language and preserving traditional customs and folktales. The Cullen Hills, a range of jagged peaks that dominate the island's skyline, are a popular destination for hikers and climbers. The Isle of Skye is one of the few places in the UK where you can still see the Northern Lights. The island's remote location and lack of light pollution make it an ideal destination for stargazing. Number 16. Mostar, Bosnia and Herzegovina Founded by the Ottomans in the 15th century and later captured by the Austro-Hungarians in the late 19th century, only to be almost wiped out by the Bosnian War in 1992. Despite the hardship, Mostar is a city that is slowly rebuilding and reconciling, while still preserving its rich cultural heritage. One of the claims to fame of Mostar is its old bridge, locally known as Stadi Most. It was completed in 1566 and was a marvel of its time before being destroyed in the 1990s during the Bosnian War. Thankfully, it was rebuilt in 2004 and was recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The bridge is an architectural masterpiece and a must-visit, spanning the Neretva River with its iconic arch and delicate stonework. Number 15. Mdina Malta. A beautiful island in the Mediterranean Sea, Mdina is located in the northern region of Malta. This place is like no other. You will be enchanted by the narrow, peaceful streets of Mdina. The city is known as the Silent City due to its ambiance and lack of traffic noise. The air is thick with a sense of history, and the ancient buildings, fortifications, and small chapels provide the ideal setting to pause and immerse yourself in the present moment. You can also visit the Fontanella Tea Gardens, which offer delicious cakes and pastries, as well as breathtaking views of the city. For those feeling adventurous, you can even take a horse-drawn carriage ride through the streets of Mdina. Number 14. Ambalavao, Madagascar A small town located in the central highlands of Madagascar, Ambalavao is surrounded by terraced rice paddies stretching out in all directions. But it's not just the beauty that it's known for. It is particularly famous for its Antaimoro paper, which is made from the bark of the native avoha tree and hand-painted with intricate designs. No trip to Ambalavao, in fact, no trip to Madagascar is complete if we don't get to see King Julian himself. Located just a few miles outside is the Anja Community Reserve. This reserve is home to a thriving population of ring-tailed lemurs, as well as many other species. Here, you'll have the opportunity to observe these fascinating creatures up close. Number 13. Aguas Calientes, Peru. Home of the iconic Machu Picchu ruins, Aguas Calientes, also known as Machu Picchu Pueblo, is a small town in the Andes Mountains of Peru. After its discovery by an American explorer in 1911, Aguas Calientes started to gain international recognition. The town itself has undergone significant development since the 1980s to accommodate the growing number of tourists visiting Machu Picchu. 
In addition to exploring the magnificent ruins of Machu Picchu, visitors can go on thrilling adventures such as hiking the Inca Trail, which offers breathtaking views of the surrounding mountains and valleys. Hiking up the steep trail to the summit of Huayna Picchu, the iconic mountain that overlooks Machu Picchu offers a full panoramic view of the citadel and the surrounding mountains. Number 12. Grand Bay Mauritius From its humble beginnings as a small fishing village, it has transformed into one of the most popular and significant tourist destinations in the country. Grand Bay is a stunning coastal village located in the northern part of Mauritius. With pleasant weather year-round, the village is famous for its beautiful beaches, water sports, and a vibrant nightlife. It offers a variety of activities, such as swimming, snorkeling, windsurfing, and water skiing. True, the village is popular for its white sandy beaches, natural beauty, and great weather, but it is equally known for its diverse culinary scene. Visitors can savor local Mauritian dishes, fresh seafood, and international flavors at the numerous restaurants, cafes, and street food stalls. Number 11. Chesky Krumlov, Czech Republic. A town like no other, Chesky Krumlov is located in South Bohemia of the Czech Republic. Situated on the banks of the Voltava River and surrounded by the Bohemian foothills. With a history dating back to the Stone Age, the town is most famous for the magnificent Chesky Krumlov Castle a UNESCO World Heritage Site with Gothic, Renaissance, and Baroque architecture. The castle, founded in the 13th century by the Witkowski family, has been the center of the town's history and culture. Today, Chesky Krumlov is known for its vibrant cultural scene, with festivals such as the Five Petaled Rose Festival, showcasing traditional music, dance, and crafts. For adventure seekers, the town offers activities such as rafting, canoeing, hiking, biking, and hot air balloon rides. Number 10. Muria, French Polynesia. While Moria is not a town, it offers a dreamy atmosphere with its breathtaking lagoons and bays. Situated in the Society Islands of the South Pacific Ocean, just northwest of Tahiti, the island features rocky, hilly terrain with its tallest mountain, Mont Tohea. The island's coastline is diverse, with the southern shore boasting white sandy beaches and clear waters, while the northern coast is rugged and rocky. In 1842, Muria became part of French Polynesia after being seized by France. Today, the island is home to traditional Mare temples that showcase its ancient Polynesian heritage. Number 9. Hallstatt, Austria. Vienna is amazing, but this one is for the people who want to experience the true charm of Austria. Hidden between the towering Dachstein Mountains and the serene Hallstatt Lake, this town boasts diverse geographical features, including dense woodland, massive cliffs, and pristine water bodies. Hallstatt's history dates back to the Iron Age, when it was a thriving salt mining town. The region's salt was exported all over Europe. The village's narrow streets, colorful houses, and cozy cafes offer a glimpse into the traditional Austrian life. 
Visitors can also enjoy a range of cultural experiences, including visiting the Hallstatt Museum, which houses artifacts from the region's prehistoric era, or taking a boat ride on the Hallstatt Lake. Number 8. Sedona, Arizona With its stunning red rock formations and lush forests, the sunny town of Sedona is located in northern Arizona. The high desert climate brings over 300 days of sunshine annually, perfect for an array of outdoor pursuits. What truly sets Sedona apart are its famous vortex sites. Believed to be areas of concentrated earth energy, these vortexes are said to hold spiritual properties that promote healing, growth, and well-being. Many visitors come to experience the life force of these locations through meditation, yoga, or other spiritual practices. To take things to the next spiritual level, you cannot miss visiting the Chapel of the Holy Cross, an architectural marvel built on a red rock cliff over a thousand feet above the valley floor. Number 7. Chefchaou in Morocco Known for its blue-painted buildings, often called the Blue Pearl of Morocco, Chefchaouen is located in the Rif Mountains. As you wander through the town's historic medina, you'll encounter notable landmarks such as the Kasbah, a 15th-century fortress housing a beautiful garden, museum, and an art gallery. The Grand Mosque, located in the heart of the Medina, is another significant historical site, featuring a striking octagonal minaret and intricate tilework. As night falls, Chefchaouen offers a more laid-back nightlife experience compared to other Moroccan destinations. Visitors can dine at cozy restaurants tucked away in the Medina or enjoy a leisurely meal at a rooftop terrace, taking in the breathtaking views of the Rif Mountains. Number 6. Cape May, New Jersey A charming coastal town located at the southernmost tip of New Jersey, Cape May is known for its beaches, stunning Victorian architecture, and natural beauty. The town's growth was slow until the mid-19th century when it became a popular summer resort for the wealthy elite from Philadelphia and New York. Today, the town is a national historic landmark with over 600 preserved Victorian buildings. The beaches in Cape May are a significant attraction with their clean white sand and calm waters. While enjoying the beach, do explore the Cape May Lighthouse. Built in 1859, this historic lighthouse offers panoramic views of the Delaware Bay and the Atlantic Ocean. Number 5. Avalon, California Situated in Santa Catalina Island, this town was purchased by a chewing gum businessman by the name of William Wrigley Jr. in 1919. You've probably tried his chewing gum before. With pleasant winters and warm summers, Avalon was envisioned to become a world-class resort destination. 
The Casino Building, which is now a cultural center and event space, was one of Wrigley's most notable contributions to the town. The town's small size and pedestrian-friendly layout make it easy to explore on foot. The beaches are a major draw, with their calm waters and soft sand. Avalon's beaches, such as the Descanso Beach, offer a tranquil escape where visitors can relax, soak up the sun, and enjoy the gentle ocean breeze. Number 4. Banff, Canada Snuggled within the heart of the Canadian Rockies and within Banff National Park, Banff is a town that boasts some of the most breathtaking landscapes in the world. The geographical features of Banff are diverse and unlike anywhere else. The Rocky Mountains dominate the landscape, with their jagged peaks and vast glaciers providing a dreamy setting to the town. The region's many lakes, including the famous Lake Louise and Moraine Lake, are renowned for their vibrant turquoise hues, which are created by the rock flowers suspended in the water. The town receives ample snowfall during the winter months, providing excellent conditions for skiing, snowboarding, and ice climbing. Summer temperatures are pleasant, with long days and cool evenings, making it the perfect time for hiking, biking, and wildlife viewing. Number 3. Queenstown, New Zealand once simply known as The Station, this town's destiny changed in 1863 at the height of the Gold Rush, when it was named after Queen Victoria. Surrounded by the Southern Alps and situated on the shores of Lake Wakatipu, the town's location provides visitors with easy access to a unique blend of natural beauty and adventure activities. Queensland is called the adventure capital of the world for a reason. From kayaking, fishing, cruising in Lake Wakatipu, to hiking, biking, bungee jumping, skydiving, as well as opportunities for skiing and snowboarding in the winter months. You name it, Queenstown has it. If you're not seeking thrills, Queenstown still has you covered with a variety of relaxing alternatives, such as wine tasting, scenic drives, and spa treatments to help you unwind and enjoy. Number 2. Hoi An, Vietnam Far from the modernity of Hanoi, in central Vietnam lies the ancient city of Hoi An. As you wander through its streets adorned with vibrant lanterns, you'll feel as if you've stepped into a magical realm. The city's history and culture come alive at every turn. No trip to Hoi An is complete without exploring the historic Old Town, where you'll find a blend of architectural styles, including wooden Chinese shop houses, Vietnamese tube houses, and French colonial buildings. The street food of Hoi An is not to be missed. Head to Tran Phu Street. This street is home to a variety of street food stalls and restaurants, offering dishes like Khao Lao, a noodle dish with udon-like noodles, roasted pork, greens, and a special sauce. Number 1. Positano, Italy 
Along the beautiful Amalfi Coast lies one of its most beloved villages, Positano, a stunning cascade of pastel-colored houses that seem to defy gravity as they cling to the steep cliffs overlooking the Tyrrhenian Sea. The region's fertile soil and temperate climate adds to its natural beauty as they support the growth of fragrant lemon groves, bougainvillea, and vineyards that blanket the landscape. With its iconic majolica tiled dome, the Church of Santa Maria Assunta is a location you simply can't miss. As evening falls, Positano's nightlife awakens. Bars and clubs draw locals and visitors alike to enjoy the nights filled with music, atmosphere, and camaraderie.